Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting and reviewing to episode one of Smile Down the Runway. So let's go ahead and get started in three, two, one, go. I think between this and Bang Dream, season three, like the, the number one thing I have been waiting for. She's so pretty. She you keep him. <laughs> girl, she as tall as me. Tall girls. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Yeah, I'm like tall. I'm like eyes that tall. Mm -hmm. Cause I don't even remember how much foot that is for 175. <laughs> True. Well, how tall is your dad and how tall is your mom? Mm, dad's tall. Mm. Oh, so you're only a hundred and fifty eight. Mm. By your own father? <laughs> well, at least she's still trying that she's got spunk. Can you walk in those heels? That too. Baby. Huh? Huh? Oh. Like I said, she got spunk. I like that about her. Paris Fashion Week <laughs> supermodel.
Junior. <laughs> nice to meet you. The supermodel? Oh. I mean, because in the sequence at the beginning, Chiyuki was there and same thing with that guy. So maybe he wants to be a designer. <laughs> yeah, Sumira. Mm -hmm. Dressmaking. Mm-hmm. Fashion designer. Well, in his own interpreted way, you know. But in a good way, not a bad way, honey. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it seems like he wants to be a fashion designer. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Why'd you change it? Yeah. Of course. <laughs> True. But don't let your dreams be dreams. Mm -hmm. Aww. <laughs>
I get that. Mm -hmm. Just always remember, no matter how many people slam your door, the door in your face saying no, there's always going to be one person that's going to say yes, and they're going to take a chance on you. Hmm? Mm, freaking allergies. And it's, like, it's the, the start of allergy season. It's mainly because of the fact that she feels so many people have told you to just give it up. You've taken that on yourself. <laughs> Seriously? Your mom? The skirt is e yeah, a skirt.
adorable I can't <laughs> that's when you realize what your passion is <laughs> of course. Yeah, but then watch her walk in. You say that, but she does. Mm -hmm. Oh, Mhm. Mm no, she's passionate. There's a line. I mean, shit, I'm six foot, so however tall she is. She can do it. Mm. <laughs> yeah, she already has a job.
Oh, but come on, let her do it at least once. Oh, shit. <laughs> mm. Yeah, you want to, you might want to call Samara. And let me guess, you want him to work for you. Mm. How much money you want for it? I mean, that, look, you can, look, it's your design. Do whatever the freak you want, bruh. Okay, all right, so first thought. I already love this show. This is good as heck. It reminds me of um, a little bit of Welcome to the Ballroom, kind of, really. Just the story of them being passionate and wanting to do and get something, in a way. Um, Chiyuki reminds me of so many other characters that I can think about right now. I'm also getting feels towards, like, any typical fashion type of show I watch. Samora kind of reminds me of, and if the, I'm about to go old school on some, some of y'all, um, from one of my personal favorite TV shows that is getting a revival and I think sometime next year in a couple of years, um, he reminds me of Jenny Humphrey from Gossip Girl and how her dream was to have her own fashion line and then by the end of the series, um, Blair gave her a fashion design through her company and through her mom's company and ish like that. So it seems a little bit like a little um, Welcome to the Ballroom meets Gossip Girl-esque with it, but it's really more the fashion side of it. A little bit kind of of America's Next Top Model or any other type of 
fashion show, even the show that's coming out on the CW next month, uh, Katie Keen, a lot of those, Project Runway and stuff, I really am going to like this because it, it hits me so close to home and how when I was a teenager, I think when I was like, when whenever America's Next Top Model officially came on around our network and around TV stations around the world, I wanted to be a model. I still do kind of in a way, but um, my biggest dream besides this is also um, entertainment journalism and talking about pop culture and possibly either working for one of my favorite networks that I watch like all the time. And that is um, E! Entertainment, aka E! News and it's like that. That would literally just be a dream for me and I would love for it to come true. But, I mean, Tayuki and Samara, they're very interesting. I'm kind of shipping them already because they look, are, like, so freaking adorable together. But I cannot wait to see what in the world is in store for these two characters. I'm wondering how long this show is because I'm guessing it's going to be maybe about 12 to 24 episodes and such. Um, okay, so one thing about this. I, I heard that this was coming out on Saturdays. Questioned it, and I was like, okay, five shows in one day, that's fine. I went to go download this because I got a message on one of my videos saying something that I had came out. And I was like, okay, but I didn't see it. And then I went on a different site and I found out that they had it yesterday. So, um, yeah, instead of you guys getting it on Saturday, you're actually going to get it on Fridays, which is really good. But I'm, I'm really excited for that. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode one of Smile Down the Runway. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Mattress Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially on Friday, 100%. Thank God. I'm actually kind of really excited the show was coming out on Friday and not Sunday or Saturday or whatever for episode two. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye. Thank you.